Aisha Mushtaq and Shazia Awan came by to check out Alan Silaboy's art. Oh yeah. That's what we've been talking about since we came, like the, the length especially, yeah. 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 <laughs> Mushtaq is talking about this snake that stretches across this wall. Silaboy painted it based on a petroglyph of a mythical horned snake. At the time of the Enigma, you know, we had a lots of powers and magic, and I wanted to bring that magic back and the scale and everything with this large, large snake. And The mural is part of an exhibit at the Dalhousie Art Gallery called Alan Silaboy, The Journey So Far, a retrospective of Silaboy's 50-year career, starting from the early 1970s. Well, this is amazing to be here because you, here's your whole it's like if, you know, if someone wrote a book, but this is like in, in a visual. This is a visual book or a record of what I was at a particular time. They're all snapshots of different periods in my life, different ages and where I was. And the gallery is located at the Dalhousie University Campus Art Center. Mushtaq says the exhibit is a step towards reconciliation. It's absolutely important and significant work to have it on campus and I think it also shows university walking the talk on its commitment to inclusion and to indigenous cultures, yes. Silaboy's work is inspired by Mi'kmaq petroglyphs, quill work and oral traditions. He is a leader in contemporary art representing Mi'kmaq culture. Curator Pamela Edmonds says the exhibit is drawing record crowds. So we've had over, you know, well over 100 people in a few days. Uh, everyone, you know, many people that are coming in telling us about, oh, I have a drum or I have a work of, our, uh, of Alan's or I used to buy his t-shirts, you know. So there's so many people's lives that he's touched with his work. The exhibit shows the evolution of Silliboy's art over the decades. A children's book, video, a guitar, drums, and paintings, such as this piece called Standing on the Hill, inspired from a photograph taken in Ottawa in 2017 during Canada's 150th anniversary protests. Silliboy says his grandparents, Charlie and Rachel Marshall, encouraged him to become an artist. My whole life, uh, uh, that inspired me, I think, to become an artist, you would be, she's very, uh, she would be very happy about uh, the way my life and career has turned out. And The snake will be painted over when the exhibit ends, but Mushtaq says it should stay. It's a good piece of art and also has that storytelling narration that the, the painter probably wants us to not just see but also understand and have a deep connection with. So I absolutely think that some more time with, uh, with, with the mural is, will be helpful. The exhibit is open to the public to August 11th. Angel Moore, APTN National News, Jabuktuk, also known as Halifax.